Shalom, Kohala, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahushai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash, that's giving all praise to the Most High, in the name of His only begotten Son, in the name of the Holy Spirit. Uh, double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone, who taught us His truth and truth and sincerity. Peace and salutations to the hopeful and scattered abroad. My name is Ibar from the Prophets in Babylon camp down here in Tampa, Florida. And in this video, real quick, I'm gonna make this long. I've already went, went into this before, but it came back up, so I figured I'll touch on it again real quick. All right, just proving that we we are getting closer and closer to that time. You had this guy Elon who just uh, put uh, he just implanted the first human with that uh, brain karagma, okay, that brain uh, micro C hip, and now um, they're going to take this thing to the next level, man. All right, they're going to take this thing to the next level. They're going to push it harder, you know. In this year, they're going to um, you know really seek to get everybody you know tagged. All right, and this is why the Lord set us up, the prophets. Started when I had elders and apostles are getting those on uh, on down first was to to warn you of this because this day is coming and these camps is not warning you of this. They will have blood on their hands. All right. So it says key kids TV series uses predictive programming for a mark of the beast. So let's play it and I put it up as a short, but I'm going to do a quick video on it as well. Your city is stunned by the sudden rollout of Rook Unlimited's most fantastic device ever. The smart mark. Throw your other devices away, because the smart mark is more than just a phone. It's part of you. Use it as cash. Book your travel. And even shoot video. Distribution points are all over the city. And don't let the lines discourage you. The Rook Unlimited smart mark is worth the wait. I never realized how wonderful technology could make me feel. The smart mark has brought order to my life. And the best part? It's absolutely free. Again. So there you go. Let's start with Habakkuk chapter 2. Verse 3, it says, For the vision. Oh, no, let me go to verse 1. It says, I will stand upon my watch and set me upon the tower, and I will watch to see what he will say unto me when I shall, and what I shall answer when I am approved. And Yahweh answered me and said, Write the vision. Make it plain upon tables that he may run that readeth it. And this is what the, the prophet saw. They saw visions. And the Lord told him to write it down so that he that readeth it may run. Meaning you read you know, this, the, the, these scriptures and you get this understanding and you run, meaning you go serve the Lord. You go, you know, uh, spread, spread the gospel. It says, for the vision is yet for an appointed time. And his vision was for an appointed time. And here we are and coming, coming into this time. Okay, 666B system, predictive programming. Will you be getting your smart mark? Okay, and this is a TV show called Neil Armstrong and the Flex Fighters. And it's pretty much showing you how they're uh, trying to program your children. You know, because it's like a superhero show or whatever. They're trying to program your children. And, it, and then this is a good episode, man. You should definitely go watch it, you know, if you, if you get the chance. I believe it's on, on Netflix. Um, You know, and, if, and a lot of things was, uh, you know, shown in, in, that, in that episode. You know, they showed the 5G towers, people getting, you know, people who took it, you know, they, they, it was turning upon, they was turning on the people that took it. They was, they was turning on the people who didn't have it. All right. And then they was able to put a frequency out telling people who, uh, who, who, uh, did have it to go after the people who didn't have it. You know, the, 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 the heroes of the show, pretty much. They was telling them to go after those people who, who, um, uh, who, who don't have it. Which, you know, that's symbolic for the prophets. You know, they were saying, you know, they turned them against the flex fighters. Also, when these characters went home, they found out their, that their family members had took it. So, you know, like I said, go watch the show. It's on Netflix. It should still be on Netflix. But it's, a, and, I, and, I, and, I, and, I, and I'm going to have to watch it again. But it's very, uh, it's very, uh, uh, you know, evident of what they're talking about. It says, um, because at the end it shall speak and not lie, though it tarry. Wait for it, because it will surely come. It will not tarry. So this thing ain't this thing ain't, this thing ain't finna delay no more. It's gonna you know come out and be you know uh, you know the main thing. All right, this is gonna be the main thing. That's why they they were saying hey, you got distribution centers all over the city. You know there was uh that's uh, well let's bring it back because she she made some points in this uh episode. You see people lined up. She said don't let the lines you know. Cause it's gonna be lines, all right. You people gonna be lined up for for for, for this garbage, all right. But this is Bible prophecy. The Lord warned us of this. Your city is stunned by the sudden rollout of Rook Unlimited's most fantastic device ever. The Smart Mark. 
throw your other devices away because the smart mark is more than just a phone. You see, he said, throw your other devices away because it's smart mark. Let's go on. It says, behold, verse four, behold, his soul, which is lifted up, is not upright in him, but the just shall live by his faith. Right. So this man's spirit ain't right. He want to get you tech. He want to put technology in your body. No one is going to cause you cancerous blisters. No one is going to destroy you. No one that is the MOTB. He wants you to do it. So he ain't right. You know, he's proud, you know, in his ways. And he, he, he ain't going to stop this man trying to uh, bring in his kingdom. It says, yeah, also because he have transgressed by wine. He is a proud man, neither keepeth at home, who enlargeth his desire as hell and is as death and cannot be satisfied. They, they can't be satisfied. They want everybody. It's not just they already enslaving you, taxing you to death. They want you. OK, it says, but gathereth unto himself all nations and he puts unto him all people. And how about this right here? He 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 he, 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 he want to put his his uh his digital old, you know, inside you. OK. They want to have full total control. You know, this, this, you know how you know that a farmer owns particular, a particular cattle is a brand that cattle. Well, Esau wants to brand you. All right. And this is how he's going to uh, push forward with his new world order agenda. OK, so beware, you know, be circumspect. Don't be, you know, don't, 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 don't get deceived with this, with the ways of, 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 of this uh, demon, man, this devil. Let's play some more. It's part of you. Use it as she said, cash. She said it is a part of you. You can use it as cash or or use it to buy stuff. And you see the woman at the get at the store scanning her hand. She's scanning her hand. All right. Let's play some more. Book your travel. Use and it for your travel. Okay. Hold on. It's moving fast. They showing you this real part quick. Of you. All right. Use it as cash. Use it to buy and sell, which the scriptures say, which, which, which we should already know. I ain't going to grab it because you should already know it. About how, uh, well, well I'm, I might have to grab it, Salakia. All right. You go after you, 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 the buy and sell. So let's grab it real quick. Revelation chapter 13, which we go through this all the time. It says, Revelation 13, verse uh, 16, he calls all, both small and great, rich and poor, everybody who was in that line, to receive a M A R K in their right hand or in their forehead. And you see, she's scanning her right hand. All right, which it don't matter which, which hand you put it in. That right just means dextrose. It could be in any hand. You know, if you're left hand, you go put it in your left hand. You know, that's why they want to put it in your forehead too, because some people don't have hands. All right, as long as they can scan it. It says, and that no man might buy or sell, save if he had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name. So this store owner cannot sell you anything if she don't get, get with the system. And this woman cannot buy anything if she don't get with the system, get with the program. All right, so so A is plain. Let's, let's, play, let's play a little more. Book your now she said, use it to travel. This is mean it's gonna be, it, it's gonna be your passport. Okay, you know you know how you have a have a passport to travel. Well, well, well this is gonna be your new passport. All right, instead of, this is gonna be your new passport. Then they um gonna have all your your uh you know your 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 stuff linked to it. Let's play some more. Travel and even shoot video. And even shoot video. Now, what this technology can do is it can, you know, it, it can be used used as a phone. You know, you can call somebody and and, and they show you that too. Like a hologram will show up in, in, in your eyesight. You know, that only you could see or something like that because because this technology is inside you. Once it's inside you, it could do all type all type of things. You know, it says um, Revelation thirteen verse fourteen, and he deceiveth them that dwell on the on the earth by the means of those miracles. So it comes it comes with all types of miracles and. You know, trick is that this thing is going to be able to do, you know, and that's going to deceive a lot of you people to jump up and go take it. It says, uh, which he had power to do in the sight of the beast, saying to them and on, on, that dwell on the earth. That it's like, yeah, saying to them that dwell on the earth, that they should make an image unto the beast, which is a new world order, um, which had a wound by the sword and did live. The Roman Empire is that beast uh, and it's been revitalized through the EU and NATO. OK, it's, it has it has came back and, you know, the European Union. OK, these Edomites are going to be the ones that's going to be pushing us out because they're the ones that are in power. All right. So you got men all over the world telling you this, tell, telling you uh, not to take it, which let's grab that because it's going to be a temptation, man. You're going to be tempted. You see how how, how, how they, you know, uh, docking it up and make it all pretty. You're going to be tempted. Oh, they're talking about all the things that it can do. You won't, you won't be able to buy and sell without it. You will be tempted. Revelation 3, verse 10. 
because thou hast kept the word of my patience, I will also keep thee from the hour of temptation, which shall come upon all the world to try them that dwell upon the earth. So you want to be kept from that hour of temptation. You know, you 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 know, you don't want to be taken by this madness, man. You know, and everybody's gonna be tried. I had a vision of that not too long ago. A couple of them, was, was was it last week? And it was like in the vision. I, it was we were literally in that time, and everybody was getting it. People was turning in, turning in their cash. But you couldn't do shit without that karagma, man. You couldn't do nothing. You couldn't go. You, you you couldn't even. Not only could you not buy, but you couldn't even enter into a store to steal something. To, to possibly thinking about it. And nowadays in these stores, they got um. Nowadays in these stores, they're locking everything up. You know, they're putting everything behind glass. You know, bulletproof doors. <laughs> All right. Why? Because they know this is coming. All right. They're getting you prepared for this right here. And we're gonna speak, keep speaking about this every chance that, that that we get to warn you. You know, I just went into this the other day, but I, you know, I, I'm, I'm going to go into it more because we in that time, you know, through the spirit of hell, I want to bring this out more. We are definitely in that time, man. With Elon Musk coming out with that news, it's going to be more um, things coming out in these, you know, upcoming weeks and months uh, going into this, man. You know, we're coming into a war time. You know, your rights are suspended. They're going to tell you, hey, this is what it is. You're going to go to the program or we're going to lock you up. Ezekiel chapter 33, verse 33. And when this comes to pass. Lo, it will come. Then they shall know that a prophet have been among them. Right. So everybody's scoffing now. Everybody talking shit. Everybody calling us crazy. We this, that, and the third. All right. Yeah, sure. For right now. But the time is coming where you gonna have to, you know, uh, uh, face the music. And then you're going to know, wow, he was right. Wow, that was a prophet. Wow, that was a man of the Lord. All right. So the time is coming, man. All right. This is why, why we tell you to repent. Seek your help. Bosh, you know, he may be found. Because the time, hey, the, the time is at hand. It says, Wisdom of Solomon, chapter 5, verse 1. Uh, then shall the righteous man stand in great boldness in the face of such as have afflicted him and made no account of his labors. We go, hey, you, because you're going to know who the man of the Lord is. Okay, when this, when this time comes, and we're going to stand in great boldness. Yeah. Okay? Because the Lord used us as vessels. He, he you know, and the Lord chooses who he wants to choose. He don't, we, we didn't choose ourselves. We, 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 we didn't sign up for this. We, we didn't go to school for, 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 for all this. The Lord set it up. It says, when. They see it, they shall be troubled with terrible fear and shall be amazed at the strangeness of his salvation so far beyond all that they looked for because the Lord is going to deliver his elect when that fire come because ultimately nuclear annihilation is going to come to America. The Lord is going to destroy all this madness, man. And they're going to, the elect will be saved via those chariots, which they call UFOs. You'll be beamed up into those ships and delivered from, from, from that destruction. And people that's down here that doubt it, that didn't believe, hey, they going to, you know, they're they going to feel it. It says, and they repenting and groaning for anguish of spirit shall say within themselves, this was he whom we had sometimes in derision and a proverb of reproach talked shit about us. They talk all kind of shit about us, man. What? Well, yeah, was this was he? Yeah. And they're going to be repenting and groaning because they're going to be like, damn, I, no, I was wrong. I'm sorry. You know, I messed up. And you like people, you, hey, you put hell upon us, bro. You put fucking hell upon us. So the Lord going to put that hell up, back upon you. Literally. It says, we fools accounted his life madness and his end to be without honor. Yeah, you're going to be seen fools. You counted our life's madness. You think we crazy? It says, how is he numbered among the children of the Most High and his lot among the saints? You're going you're gonna to be thinking, how, how is, no, how is he, you know, numbered among the, the lot of the saints? You know, how is he, you know, a, a, a child of the Most High? All right. So. We definitely coming into some interesting times and it's only going to get more and more you know, evident in these last days who the true man of the lord is man and that's why we give uh all praises you know to you how about for blessing us with this marvelous knowledge giving us this truth you know and allowing us to endure in it man all right to, to and, and and keep the commitments to the best of our ability you know it's, it, it is a blessing we are forever grateful so with that being said i'm gonna say shalom kwamashirala bible ball